Do me a favour. When you get Natalie and Brulia on, David, around 1998, I was at a BT product launch party for the advertising (laughs) agency I worked at. (laughs) And the actor John Sim was there as he had done some (laughs) voiceovers. I got chatting to John. He said he was going to Natalie's <laughs> after show party. <laughs> I think she had played Elle's Court. Anyway, I pleaded with John to take me there and he refused because I was too drunk on free vodka. <laughs> Ask Natalie if she remembers me not being there, please. <laughs> what a waste of his time. Dan Bryant. Cracking little London idea. <laughs> oh, go on, man. Hi, guys. Listen to your London walk ep- episode. As always, great stuff. Have you heard of mudlarking? Yeah, you're at the 80th person of even who's <laughs> emailed in, Dan. What is it? I think it's like being a human womble searching the riverbank for cool stuff. There's, it's never going to happen. <laughs> Say that about any of this. There's Instagram accounts you could check out. <laughs> I bet either or both of you could squeeze some lovely content from that. <laughs> Thank you for that. I don't know what this is. This is from Bill Richards. Crunch, okay. crunch from the USA. Crunch, crunch, David and Joe. I'm Bill Richards from Milton, <laughs> West Virginia, USA. I wanted to send you all a message letting you know that after just over two years, I've finally caught up to the latest episode, Chatterbix. I started listening after David's interview on Parenting Hell, as at the time I was running out of podcasts. I knew Joe from Cat's Dust Countdown, and after listening to David's Parenting Hell interview, I thought I would enjoy the two of you together. And boy, was I right. Oh, my God, I love Bill Richards. I'm looking at where he lives. It's a tiny little uh, town near Huntington, and the next town along is called Hurricane. Don't get me wrong, I love other podcasts too, but yours seems to be genuine and not forced or restrained by a set format. You can flow from one idea to another without being too chaotic. Thank you so much, Bill. So that could have been spun as a massive negative on one of our reviews. All of that just, ma- anyway. Your pod has also been educational as well as entertaining. <laughs> That's it. Thank you very much, Bill. All this to say thank you for entertaining me over the past few years. I look forward to new episodes. Keep up <laughs> the good work. That's Bill <laughs> Richards, Milton, West Virginia. Oh, my God. What? I'm resending this with the subject this time. Mother Earth People Tree. Acid Jazz would love to send David a copy of Mother Earth's People Tree album. Which is being re-released on vinyl for its 30th anniversary. Oh, my God. My husband is Eddie Piller, founder of Acid Jazz. Oh, my God, I would love that, Melanie Pillar. Sorry, who are they, who's this again, sorry? Oh, that doesn't mean anything to you. Yeah, but tell me. No. <laughs> well, I'll listen back then. You know when I used to wear my Ron Atkinson coat and dress oh, yeah. like a cool dude? <laughs> yeah, that was well, them. I never felt, I was never a cool dude. Never, no, nothing ever quite. sat right <laughs> on my body. Still doesn't. Uh, yeah. and It, it anyway. was based on them. No, that, that, no. That, they were a record label that had loads of good bands on it. Who were? What were they called again? Acid Jazz. Oh, fuck. fuck. <laughs> well, I can't know everything. I don't know anything. Acid <laughs> Jazz. I've heard of Acid Jazz. I thought it was a type of music. On to the next. In not, enga- not even engaging with that. <laughs> Well, it was a type, but they they were they were anyway. No, they were a record label called Acid Jazz. And and he, what's he said? What's and Melanie Pillar has got in contact. Yeah, and she said, "My husband is Eddie Pillar, founder of Acid Jazz." And what's he sending you? I read all this out. I know, but it was just noise to me because I didn't know what anything was. A copy of Mother Earth's People Tree album. So Mother Earth is the band. The People Tree album is the cover. Remember the cover of the four blokes leaning against the tree trunk? Yes, like yes. Copy. Okay, this is, yeah. <laughs> this is this is what I'm trying to So the people you copied, the one at the back that you copied, which was... Well, the lead singer. Lead singer, okay. No, was it the lead singer? No, no he was I don't, wearing another little brown yeah, suit. Yeah, exactly. No, it was a... another one, but like the bassist or something. 
yeah. lean against the tree. You copy. Now you're getting a copy of their record. Yeah, it's the 30th anniversary. Yeah, cool. That's what I wanted to know. Thank you. <laughs> and also, it's probably, uh, quite, it's probably quite nice for the listener because they're probably going, right, I can't remember everything you've talked about. <laughs> Where you just skipped give over. A shit. <laughs> well, you skipped give over. A shit. All the information is you read it really quickly and then email replied in silence. <laughs> excited <laughs> yeah and i wanted to like say <laughs> hi this is jennifer taylor my husband does glenn hoddle's posters would you yeah. like one <laughs> yeah i'd go yeah right you'd be emailing and, straight away yeah and if you said who i'd go glenn hoddle's <laughs> pa has said she's gonna get no, I'll go, oh fuck it i'll listen to it when it comes out <laughs> well no because you weren't anyway <laughs> jesus move on <laughs> I think I'm in the right here because you, you are in the right. <laughs> you are in the right. What a lovely. Thank you. I appreciate that. It takes a lot to say that. To admit that. <laughs> nice really guy. Does. Really nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> so in the end, you won. Oh, this is great going through this. Yeah, Why really. We done, we've, we've had emails for four years. <laughs> Should we go back to the very <laughs> yeah, first? Yes. One? Yes. <laughs> so out of context. I'll pick one from three years ago. <laughs> uh, it's from Mike Fox. Hi, Joe and David. Hope you're both well. Message for Joe mainly. I've just bought tickets for Paul Fuss at the Corn Exchange, 26th of October. It's nearly sold out. I'm sure you'll get a comp ticket as he's one of your buddies, but just letting you know in case you haven't seen it. Worst case, you can sit with me and I'll bend the missus off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cheers, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> cool. David's walking details. Actually, I'm not bothered. Crunch, crunch. Moss and Brown. <laughs> Tour manager, stage manager. Mango so, touring. So he's not bothered about your... No. Walk. <laughs> oh, dear. What's his name? Uh, Martin Brown. He's a tour manager for Mango Touring. <laughs> Never heard of him. This is from Lizzie Hode. David, I thought this might make you laugh. Very proud of my son setting up his own gardening business. This is the unintentionally funny flyer he's made and distributed. <laughs> Read the last line, even if you skip the rest. Oh, this is amazing. I love this <laughs> shit. Yeah, I do. We are Felix and Zach. We're both 15 years old. <laughs> and have over a year's, ex have over a year's experience. <laughs> <laughs> And only charge £10 an hour each. That's 20 quid. <laughs> we also have a Facebook page with photos of our previous jobs. We offer a range of affordable services, giving a detailed and visible change to your garden. We can take care of your hedges, <laughs> flower beds, patio, and general de-weeding and more. <laughs> we have all the tools needed other than... Other than a lawnmower. <laughs> you got a fork and a spoon. <laughs> what do they do? <laughs> we can take care of your edges by doing what? <laughs> I love how I love how brutal you're being. Oh, dee weeding, weeding. What's dee weeding? Putting <laughs> weeds back in. <laughs> Just letting them grow. <laughs> and more. <laughs> what like? Yeah, that. We can say and more. <laughs> And Moore's really good. It's what? got their number here. Please ring them up and interrogate them. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not bringing two 15 year olds up and having a pop. <laughs> you mean de weeding? Oh. 